Hey guys, it's the Dark Agent back with another Raid Shadow Legends video. So today we're going to be going over the unkillable team statistics for anybody trying to set the unkillable up. So I ran my three key today, 83 mil. We got, see here at the top. We have, well, me and Kyle are using the same team, but you can run a long beard. What else do we have? There's different variations of it. You know, Tea Leaf got one here. He's running a, a two key. Just as long as you have the. Um, ew. Stupid Facebook notifications. God. <laughs> as long as you have your two man eaters. So we'll go over statistics. Go over the man eaters first, because they gotta be the fastest. All right, so my team isn't even fully leveled up really yet, so it's a lot of potential for more damage. I run like 33 mil at the most, almost a two key if I land two key is good. So here's the 248 speed man eater. Here's a 246, both of them 75% crit, it's good. So, then it goes Frozen Banshees. God, these, what is going on with Facebook? I don't even use that thing really. Here's Banshee at 212 speed. All right. Then we got Rosin. 207 speed and then not that skull crusher but this skull crusher we got 205 right so your slowest is 205 205 207 212 246 and 248 are the speeds you want now once you get the speeds like let's see here the 248 man eater all right once i got the speeds i went ahead and looked at my pieces like okay that's a one speed roll there on a six star that's a two speed roll on a five star didn't even hit speed there on the shield all right we got two on the on the glove with no glyph we got one speed roll on the chest, and look, my dude's got an accuracy on. He's got a freaking accuracy chest on, and he's doing this. Five star speed boot, but it's all the speed set, right? The banner. Yeah, the banner had two speed hits. So after you get your speeds, you go back over and try to get that crit rate and crit damage up on all your tunes. So you'll just get, like, let's say. Let's see here. Hello again? All right, so this shield, six speed, right? So we're gonna go. Substats, speed, grip on everyone. So we know we have to stay with a speed shield or it's gonna break the set. So we're looking on all these pieces. Who has six? Who has six? And if any of them have six, do they have crit rate? That's 17. Wow, that's a 7. See, I'm not even using a double double speed roll on a 6 star there. I'm not even using it. Alright. So who's got 6? Anyone got 6? That's 4. I could, I could, I would need to glyph that to 3 more, but that's no crit chance, right? See, that brings my crit rate down, so we don't want that. 14. Got some good shields. I'm not even using. Jeez. That's four. Let's see, here's six. Speed six. But my crit rate, it doesn't help me. So that's what you're trying to do. You're trying to get your speeds and then look. You know who who can um who can get more crit rate and crit damage. 
this one I could probably probably even put a crit damage on here go with something like this and get 40% crit damage off this instead of 18 because the health don't matter it's all about cranking the damage out into 50 turns so we'll go over to masteries now I just wanted to ramble on about try to when you, once you get the speeds don't just give up there look at your crit rate man and crit damage because you can always build that out that's what pushes the two key and three key and stuff so masteries here <clears throat> just went full war master no turn meter manipulation same thing on both of them Rosin's masteries were messed up. T Leaf actually redid this for me. Big shout out to T Leaf. Hooking it up. Some pretty good masteries there. Looking good, looking good. So we had Skull Crusher. Frozen Banshee. I actually want to go back on her and find some uh, more crit rate. But the thing of it is, you also need to worry about her accuracy. So I know there's some... That's a good crit rate piece. So 10, yeah, this can actually be changed to full crit right down here. Let's check this out. She can, this is great actually. No, and it has speed roll, can't have that. Hello, beautiful. See, this is why you do this type of stuff. Ooh. Probably want to do these. good crit rate off that and that just ups our damage the thing of it is is to build the crit rate So I've showed up, I've showed up, you know, one of the keys here, back when I was learning the, <laughs> learning the order for the unkillable. It's pretty bad, but uh, yeah, I do it every day now, so the order is pretty much. I can do it in my sleep. So she just have forty percent. We pumped her up to seventy three percent, and I still got quite a bit more to go. She'll be a hundred percent. She's still 212, that's great. Yeah, her defense is super low now, so if she goes on anything else, she's going to need those gloves back, which is no problem. But yeah, that's the, um, that's the unkillable statistics. We can help you guys out if you need any help. You know, shoot us a message, join the Discord, go to 
the clan here. There's a Discord link. Hit us up. Shoot T Leaf a message, anyone a message, just say hi in the Discord, people will help you out. But if you have any um questions too, you can put them in the comment section or anything like that. But I just wanted to put the um, statistics up because last video I said I was gonna do it and I didn't, so get these stats out for the man eaters for you guys real quick. Yeah, that's another one, man. I'm just clowning around. Dark Agent, and I'm signing out.